everybody. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I am working on a research paper that is due tomorrow that I've been working on for forever for many hours of the day for many days in a row and it is super 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 late. I think it's after 3 in the morning. It's technically Thursday now but I still consider it Wednesday because I haven't gone to bed yet. <laughs> so to me it's Wednesday but officially it's Thursday. But I've been working on this paper for a while. I took a break and got on Amino and looked at some of those because for anyone who doesn't know I now have three aminos. I have one for Chatty Shelby. I also have one for the VI Gamer, which is my gaming channel. And then I have another one, which is called Beautifully Bi. And that one is primarily for people that identify as bisexual, but it's really for anyone either in the LGBTQ plus community or that is an ally or just wants to know more like whatever whatever the case may be as long as it's in a supportive and positive manner it's basically a just a safe place for LGBTQ plus related discussions so that is the one that's not based on a channel but the other two are based on this channel like I said and my gaming channel and they both have the same names Chatty Shelby and the VI Gamer so <clears throat> if y'all are interested I'll try to remember to put the links in the description there is all kinds of stuff that you can do on there polls questions blog posts you can share links you there's public and private chats there's all kinds of stuff that you can do and that'll be kind of my primary way to interact with you guys. I mean, I'll still use Twitter and Facebook for like quick updates and stuff as well as Amino, but in terms of like having discussions and asking all questions and things like that, I will be using Amino from now on. So if you would like to be an active part of the community, then you should definitely go check out the Chatty Shelby Amino. So I've been looking through those and kind of taking care of some stuff on those as well as looking at other aminos that I'm a part of because I'm I'm a part of quite a few but I only I only own three of them but I did that for a while and then I created a Wattpad account and started putting some of my poetry on there that I have written over the years unfortunately the two stories that I had written and had at least 20 pages on or whatever those are no longer in existence I thought they were on my hard drive my external hard drive but evidently they are not so I have no way of uploading those Unless I rewrite them, but even then it won't be exactly the same because I've been writing them over several years. So I'm kind of bummed about that. Actually, I'm really bummed about that. I'm not going to lie. Because those were stories that are really important to me. And I wanted to share those with everyone as I'm writing them. But they don't exist anymore, so now I have to start working on something else. So if you would like to see what I write next or the poems that I've already written, then you can find me on Wattpad as Blind Visionary. But it is super late and I want to at least get a little bit further on my paper because like I said it's due tomorrow. So I would like to get a little bit more done before I go to bed, even though I'm really tired. But I will see y'all tomorrow. I have two classes, and then I normally go to church home group, but I don't know if I will. One, I don't know if I'll have a ride, and two, 
Even if I do, I don't know if I'm gonna have time because of this paper. All right, I apologize for the lighting. Like, there's not a really good spot for me to position myself in the car without the light being shining right at y'all. But I am in the car right now with Miss Glenna in the back. We are at Walmart. Karis had to run in to get a couple things, but they're in the same spot. So I was like, well, I'll just wait in the car. And we got some dinner from Taco Casa and ate most of that at our friend's house. And I have my Casa Delights that I'm finishing up right now. And then once she gets back from Walmart, we are headed to the church retreat. I think it's like an hour and 15 minutes away or so. So we're gonna start heading that way and then have some fun after this super stressful week. It is really nice to get to do this. It's been my motivation for the week. So I'm glad it's finally here and I'm done with my research paper and everything. So let's go have some fun. speaking really quiet because Karis is already in bed so I don't want it to be disturbing but I am back now Miss Glenn is sitting next to me on the couch passed out she had a really hard and stressful weekend with everything going on and trying to guide me and and it was like really crowded and everything so she she had a, a busy difficult weekend so she is some much needed rest. The her retreat was amazing. It was so needed. I got to connect with God and I got to get to know some people better than I had already known them and we just had a good time and worshiped the Lord and I just I absolutely enjoyed it and I'm so glad that I went and that I had the opportunity to go and I just hope that the spiritual closeness that I felt this weekend will not diminish in the coming days and weeks. I know I'm going to be super busy with school, midterms are coming up, and big papers and everything, but I'm hoping that I can continue to grow closer to God, which I've been working on already anyway, so. It was just, it was a great weekend. I wish I could have vlogged or wish I had had the opportunity to vlog, but there were so many people that like, I couldn't really, if anyone didn't want to be in the video, there wasn't really a way for me to know where they were to avoid them because there were a whole lot of us so 
I didn't want to risk getting anyone in the video that didn't want to be, but I'll try to get at least some scenery shots for y'all. But now I'm just doing homework for a while because I don't want to be doing homework all day tomorrow. I have most of my stuff is due tomorrow and Tuesday this week. So then the rest of the week I can get ahead and study for midterms and everything. But I also want to get as much as I can done now so that tomorrow I am not doing homework all day and I can either get ahead on stuff that's coming up, like studying for midterms, or I can catch up on shows, whatever the case may be. I want to have the ability to decide that. So I'm going to get back to homework. And <laughs>